Hi, I just got out of the uh, transit. Uh, just cleared the Insta transit there. Uh, we're behind that door. Okay, let me just see just uh, what we can find. We're actually, lots of. The thing here is that there are lots of shops here, but they don't have any windows where you could uh, watch planes or spot planes. Anyhow, we'll just go around. So they have uh, Toyshka dolls. Yeah. How much could that be? Okay, I think you can find the price behind. It's 439 euros, is it? Alright, so kind of expensive here. If it's rubbles, uh, let me see. Hi, uh, the prices here are in euros, is it? Small or rubbles? 60 euros. 60 euros? Oh, okay. Thank you. Alright, so. Okay, so again, this is uh, this is where I came from, that area, and uh, so when we arrived at the, when we got there, uh, we just had to pass through. It's not it's not really uh, immigration, but they do check on your passport and your boarding pass if you're really transiting through Sharmatia um, Airport. And uh, okay, souvenir shops. They got flags, chocolates. Mm. Oh, okay. Chocolates. Alright. So, again... Uh, yeah, okay, they don't have windows there, so you don't get to see the plane if you guys are um, Asian aviation enthusiasts. Uh, this is not an ideal place to go plane spotting. Unless... Uh, well, I'm not quite familiar with this airport yet, but, but maybe they do have areas here where you can do that. Okay, so we're on our way, walk to um, let's go walk towards uh, Terminal E. Okay, so that's those are directions. Some of them are Cyrillic, so <laughs> we can't really read. Uh, here's another shop that uh, has Matryoshka dolls, but oh yeah, look, putting shirts. So again, you can see um, goods there being sold. So, if you guys are fans of uh, Russian-made stuff, be sure you got um, you're packed with lots of funds. <laughs> okay, now we're going up to. Let's go. Check out some Matryoshka dolls. There we go. This is 600. Oh, 65. They look nice though. It's 1000 rubles. Is it? Yeah, we'll get back to that. Okay, so this is uh, the way to Terminal E. Okay, still no windows except for that. Um, this is just one spot right here where you can actually watch planes. But this is just this area that I know. 737. Alright, so. Now we gotta go. Okay, um, my agenda here is uh, I need to go to. I'm going to find. I need to find the no, um, V Express. So it looks like I gotta 
go up. Yes, but looks like more and more. Okay, let's go ask someone. Hello, where's Terminal E? Yeah, no. Oh, this one. Okay, thank you. Okay, so he says we're in Terminal E already. Okay, um, this terminal looks better than uh, the previous one. I'm not sure if this is the newer terminal, but anyway, lots of shops. Oh, okay, I got distracted by just uh, looking at this. My, uh, actually, some of my friends are ask, uh, already know that I'm here in Russia and then they just want some souvenirs. Okay, uh, let me check. This one sells for like 28 euros. All right, that's small. But yeah, what else do they have? Still the Putin shirts and uh, dolls. And uh, scarves, other than gadgets and candies, magnets. All right. Oh, good. There's a window where you could do plane spotting. Okay, guys, we're already in uh, Terminal E. So, this is a better area compared to the previous one again. Um, yeah. Okay, now I just gotta check where V Express is. Actually, I have no idea where is it, where it's at. But well, I'll be checking it a while ago. Uh, later, rather. Okay, good. Familiar food places. We got Burger King. Okay, so that's just a. Uh, Okay, let's just uh, go find some place to stay first to check in because I know there are sleeping pods here. I just gotta do this. Uh, okay, if uh, Terminal F a while ago didn't have windows, this one is simply perfect. Right, so simply spot lots of things. to look for V Express. Okay, uh, just to let you guys know that I arrived using Aeroflot in, from Hong Kong and uh, we ar arrived uh, in Terminal F, uh, went through transit. Oh, there's a capsule hotel. Okay. I'm not sure if that's open 24 hours, but it should be. But that's not the one we need. It says capsule hotel. Yeah, there's not much space, so if you guys need to go to the restroom, I don't know where you guys are gonna go. 
Capsule. Okay, that's Capsule Hotel. This is how it looks like. Okay, I think this is uh, cheaper compared to the one I'm looking for. Planes. Okay, there's Comfort Hotel. Okay, I was just uh, there at the Comfort Hotel and they inquired about the room and customer service is really bad. <laughs> I, said, I said, hello, do you have any like rooms? Or, and she, she was just staring at the computer as if she didn't hear me. I don't know, I was just standing there for like 10 seconds. I'm trying to make myself like, hello, hello, I'm here. <laughs> Voila. So anyhow, I'll just go look for some place to stay. Your attention, please. Passengers on this flight are invited to board at gate 54. <laughs> Okay, so I got this souvenir and it costs like uh, 700 rubles. There you go. <laughs> yeah. they, also, they also have lots of souvenirs here, but this one's already 950. So I'm going to a bar. So I, one of the agenda here in uh, going to Russia is to get the drink, real vodka. Well, you can get vodka anywhere, but just to try out vodka here and caviar. Hello, I'm back. <laughs> so this is uh, my our host. Uh, what's his name? Raman. 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 Yes. Oh, uh, Raman. Okay. And then uh, we're going to try out the vodka. He's. Uh, he, is it strong? I think it's strong. It's about uh, 40 degrees. 43. Uh, <laughs> 40 degrees. <laughs> Will I be able to wish you later? What can I say? Russian what can I say? Okay. 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 You must do it. Okay, this we gotta try. Try this. The hotel bus machine express invites you to have a rest before your departure in comfortable conditions. Okay, so that much vodka. We drink it straight. Yes. Uh, okay. And drink this about okay. this one. Yeah. All right. Mm -hmm. Man, this is so good. Anyhow, this is really good. Actually, this is the one of the cheap ones um, that we uh, that I was able to get. The really expensive one are the sturgeon caviar, the black ones. Uh, so for this, uh, only fits my budget. But anyway, it's caviar in Russia with a plane behind me. Mm. Mm -mm. Good. A little bit, don't usually drink, and then chaser, and then caviar. And drink it out. Mm -mm. Mm Anyway, all I can say is that um, Terminal F, no, Terminal E looks better, <laughs> way better than Terminal F. I, it just looks new, and uh, you got lots of windows there where you could do a, do plane spotting. So anyhow, um, I hope uh, from whatever walk around I did from Terminal F to Terminal E was able was uh, of help to you guys. It's just easy to find it. You know, these terminals are interconnected. I'm tired from a nine-hour flight. <laughs> Okay.
Okay, so we're here at. Uh, oh, this is the V Express Hotel, and then uh, yeah, we're getting. I'm doing a vlog, <laughs> so we're going to stay here with the room with the window. So it's it's gonna cost us about how much is it? One hundred forty dollars. Okay, I'll take it. It's a uh, hundred and forty dollars for like a. Uh, uh, what, what is this? About eight hours stay. It's hundred and forty. I guess it's not bad. Just it's better than going to the other hotel, which is the hotel where in they would lock you, <laughs> but you get to go outside the airport. So, so here. Okay, um, I'm going to look for room number 32. Oh, okay. So, that's the restroom. Hello. So, this is the room with the window. <laughs> 